Hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping over today. I appreciate you. Today's video, at oh, one love you guys. I'm going to show you my finished music journal. This was so fun to make. Oh, string. I feel like a cat. You know, there's a string. Gotta pull it. So, yeah. Just found this old book and um, I did a, the binding on it. Put a little button there with the fabric. And I didn't have any music fabric, so I just chose something that went well with the dark green cover. And uh, this was just a napkin that I found at a Goodwill. So I just added it with some lace, and I put that button on. That's just the binding on the seams on the edges. And I sewed those together and added a button to hide that ugly sew job. Because I'm not great at sewing. Anywho, so yeah, I'm... Uh, I'm anxious to show you the rest of this, but first I want to say hi to a new sub, Kimberly Winters. Thanks for coming on over. Love you. Thanks for stopping by and being uh, part of our little community here. All right, let's get started. So I found um, a few library cards in my stash of things um, that just, you know, and they were cards from songs of books found some music paper also and made a few extra cards and in this front pocket uh, front cover I put that pocket and if you saw the previous videos you saw saw me working on different aspects of this journal finishing things up and giving all the pages the little bit of attention that I thought it needed and, and some people would put more in some people would put less this is part of my program from my senior recital and that's something else you got to hear if you watched a previous video is me singing in my senior recital in 1989 uh yeah it's <laughs> I'm not bragging it's great but it was different it's different <laughs> So on these pages, I use lots of different things, uh, tuck spots, journaling cards, napkins, um, music paper that I had in my stash. This is tissue paper from the Dollar Tree. The uh, pocket there was from the book that I took this apart from. And uh, here's some more fabric that I used to just decorate the edge of this page. And um, yeah project life card some stenciling here and there just whatever I had on hand here's a little flip out um, I'm sure there's a fun name for that but I can't think of it <laughs> the striped paper is fun but it's a little much but I love all the different layers that I've got going on in here some fabric layers and just with the paper and that is that's a card that I made from a master board uh, that I scanned and printed. And that piano, again, is from a, a recital program I still had left over. And I, why I kept that, I do not know. But yeah, just a journaling card with some stamping on it. And that was a free printable. I couldn't tell you where from. I don't remember. But check one of the v previous videos out. It has uh, some resources on it. And... Uh, the vellum was an interesting thing to work with, I must say. That was from, that journaling card with the bird on it is from um, one of those wonderful magazines, Somerset. So, I love those magazines, so inspirational. So mostly just things from my stash that I've had. I found a pack of, what got me started on doing a music journal is I found a pack of um, Project Life cards that were all music and I just said okay I want to make a music journal I'm just now getting to this so and um, what I'm going to do with this music journal oh here, and here's a writing board so because some of the pages are bumpy so I just took a piece of mailer covered it both sides with some paper washi tape the edges yeah so what I'm going to use this for I think is putting in and some of my favorite worship songs or Personally, the songs that I've written or some poems that I've written, I can put those in here. My favorite hymns, I could put those in here. Musical quotes would be great to add. Oh, this is just a, a card with napkins on it and some lace sewn on the side or ribbon sewn on the side. Um, concert tickets, if I ever go to a concert, that would be a great thing to add in here. Um, 
lists of my favorite mu YouTube musicians. I got several of them that I listen to on a regular basis and some of the songs that I appreciate from them. That would be a great thing to put in here. Um, just anything related to music, you know, songs from my past that um, mean anything to me, you know, you know, I don't like the song that uh, we didn't have a dance at our wedding, but if we had a song from that, you know, from our wedding or from, you know, our song, that would be good to put in here, you know, mine and Chris's. And so, yeah, just add a little bit of fabric here and there just to soften up the edges. And this was a master board that um, I ended up scanning and I have on my computer for whenever I I want to use it again so and that's actually the actual actual master board the hard copy so so I enjoyed doing this you guys I had a lot of fun I hope you enjoyed it too and I'm just curious what you know what kind of stuff are you working on or if you have a music journal what do you put in it um, just leave that comment below I'd love to know and uh, and then just yeah just say hi yeah dollar tree tissue paper pack really nice that was also at the dollar tree you make me smile there's a cute little oh and that that uh, those people were from a beethoven book that i got from the elementary school i used to work at and they were giving things away at the library and i grabbed that book and uh, yeah some of the words in here like that music word are from that book so that's that's a little plus, a little, a little shout out to my little Twin Oaks family over in, in uh, Eugene, Oregon. At Beethoven, he was a musician and uh, talent that was in that book as well. And, and uh, the interesting thing about this belly band is the word octave on it. So a musical term. And Stephen Kellogg's Yankee Doodle. So it just had some fun finding things all over in my craft area that had things to do with music. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you get your tools out and your supplies out. And this was just a theme journal that I wanted to do for a long time. And uh, now I've got it done and I'm excited to work in it. Um, just a simple tie around band for the closure. Okay, you guys, thanks again for stopping by. I do love you. And I, I so am happy that you're creating or hopefully you're creating. And this gives you some ideas to get going on something of your own. And it doesn't have to be as complicated as this either, too. So um, be happy, be healthy, my friends. And as always, God bless everyone. Bye bye. <music>